you see in Africa right now, over 90% of the MPOX cases are among children. So these demonic people are coming for our children. And be sure the last time you said no to the vax for your children, but they're already talking about getting vaccines ready for this new disease. You're gonna have to share this information. You're gonna have to subscribe, like, and comment so we could get it out. Others could know and start pushing back as well. What am I talking about? There is a new incurable infection caused by a mosquito. Right now, in Massachusetts, in the United States, a number of towns are under lockdown from 5 p.m. in the evening because of this new infection. Of course, it appears that the infection is a Nicodemus. It only travels by night. But these are how demons operate. They only travel by night most of the time. So that's when they do their thing undercover when you are sleeping, when I are sleeping. That's why I say to you, we have to start pushing back on these things. You're going to get on your knees. Now... These towns in Boston, a new mosquito virus, there's no cure for it, and you could actually die from it. All right? Let's go to this story. There's a new health warning out for that. Health warning as New Hampshire man dies from mosquito-borne brain swelling virus. It's already starting to scare us. All right? A man in New Hampshire has died after testing positive for rare mosquito-borne virus. Health officials in Hampstead, New Hampshire, issued a warning Tuesday after a resident died from the Eastern Queen Encephalitis Virus, also known as Triple E. I'm not going to call that long word again. So when I'm talking about it, I'm going to talk about Triple E, right? The condition which is carried by mosquitoes causes a fever and brain swelling and can lead to seizures, comas, killing around a third of those it infects. It's the state's first human case in 10 years. The announcement comes after half of the state of Massachusetts remains under curfew after 10 counties issued warning of an elevated presence of the virus. Cities across the U.S. are being sprayed down with pesticides to deter mosquitoes, which are becoming increasingly disease-ridden. Of course, they're becoming increasingly disease-ridden because these demonic people are messing with the mosquitoes. They keep doing this. They're creating mosquitoes. They're letting them go on the population. And they're saying to you and me that these mosquitoes are going to take out the other ones. They call them the bad ones that gave you dengue and all that kind of stuff. But they're spreading in the meantime. These are syringe mosquitoes, right? This has been going on for a long time. And if you don't believe me, listen to this. Listen to this video right now. From a contractor to Fort Detrick, um, working on uh, weaponizing fleas, ticks, and mosquitoes, trying to mass produce them, stuffing fleas with the plague, uh, stuffing mosquitoes with deadly Trinidad virus, Trin Trinidad virus, and then stuffing ticks with either deadly or incapacitating, hassipating diseases like relapsing fever, Venezuelan equine encephalitis, rabies, uh, leptospirosis, which is another spirochete. You heard her mention Eastern equine encephalitis that's the same disease same infection mosquito-borne infection that is now spreading in those towns in boston and that's the same infection that killed the first man they said died right you gotta pay attention you're not paying attention they're creating these infections these diseases in labs and then they're telling you and i that we have to take a chuck to get rid of it well this one has no cure so they're letting go these things on the populations right now i bet you didn't know that there was one called the trinidad virus right now in trinidad they're testing for one called the Arapuch virus 
it's now in South America and it's now in Europe where a man came back from Cuba and he was tested positive for that virus. I'm telling you, pay attention. These demonic people are on the loose and they're out to get us. Look at how wicked these people are. You remember this guy Fauci was popular in the lockdowns of 2020, 2023. And remember the interview with Dr. McKenzie on TVJ, she mentioned clade 1B. Remember I told you about that with the MPOX? Huh? Right. These people are doing it again. And if you don't believe me, look at what happened here with Fauci. Dr. Anthony Fauci's department hit plans to create mutant monkeypox virus that could have started pandemic bombshell Congress report. And they're saying that Fauci's former department deceived Congress over its plans to create a Frankenstein Mpox virus that had pandemic potential and new report says. It's not a plans to create, they did create it. They have done it and it's now creating havoc in Africa and it's spreading to various countries around the world very soon it will be at a shore near you and a country near you as a matter of fact remember chief medical officer said that they're ramping up and they're getting ready to test for that whenever it hit the shores of jamaica and she said that the vaccine is not for those in a regular population, but only for those who are infected with the virus. But you can be sure, she said, as of now, it's not for you. It's for those infected with the virus. But get ready. They're coming with the lockdowns again. It's already started in the U.S. over this mosquito-borne virus. They're coming with the MPOX. COVID is on the rise again, and they're coming. They're getting ready to do more lockdowns. We have to start to push back on these demonic people. You have to share this information. You have to share this video or else people won't know. So you heard, I just read there about Fauci and what they're doing. So they have been messing with nature, constructing viruses, and then tell us that the only thing to be rid of these viruses is to take the vax. These are not ordinary people. These are high demons in high places. And the only way to be rid of them is to push back spiritually. You cannot fight them any other way. But you'll have to share this video so that others can know what we're talking about. All right? They're also getting ready to push the vax on you again. What am I talking about? Check this out. WHO invites MPOX vaccine manufacturers to submit dossiers for emergency Valuation. It says WHO has issued an invitation for manufacturers of MPOX vaccine to submit an expression of interest for emergency use listening. Listen. The WHO director announced on 7th August that he triggered the process for EUL of MPOX vaccine given worrying trends in the disease spread. So they're already talking about vaccines and getting all their people together to make new vaccines. Don't fall asleep. Be awake. We have to push back on this kind of behavior. These are demons, like I say to you. These are demons in high places. They're not ordinary people. All right? Let's go to this one as well. If you don't believe me, something is coming sometime around September. Goes all the way until next year. Global Strategic Preparedness and Response Plan launched by WHO to contain MPOX outbreak. World Health Organization launched a global strategic preparedness and response plan to stop outbreaks of human-to-human -human transmission of MPOX through coordinated global, regional, and national efforts. So it's not only gonna be global, it's not only gonna be regional, but it's also gonna be national, meaning in your country, all these Caribbean countries as well. This follows the declaration of a public health emergency of international concern on the 14th of August, the current plan is subject to inputs by member states. Jamaica is part of the WHO, right? All these Caribbean countries are part of the WHO, and the current plan is subject to inputs by member states who were briefed on the plan on Friday, 23rd August. Check this out. 
the current plan is subject to inputs by member states who were briefed on the plan on Friday, 23rd August. So while everybody was distracted, while those in St. Vincent were distracted by cartel, the WHO briefed the Vincentian government on this plan, the Jamaican government, the Dominican government, the St. Lucian government, the Trinidadian government, all the governments in the Caribbean were member states of WHO. They were briefed on the plan on Friday, 23rd August. Check this out. The plan covers the six month period of September, 2024 to February, 2025, envisioning a US 135 million funded for the needed response by WHO member states. See what I'm telling you? The plan is for a six month period, September, 2024 and February, 2025. Everything is coming together because these demonic people, they're getting ready to deal with us again. And if we don't push back on these people, they're going to take us out. You have to share this video. You have to share the video so people can know what is happening. Remember I told you the CMO of Jamaica, Dr. McKenzie, said there is no need to vax the population against MPOX as of now. So down the road, watch out because they have already been briefed by the WHO as to the plans, right? For September this year, all the way to February next year, 2025. And if you don't believe me, everything is coming back. Even COVID is making a resurgence, not only in the Caribbean, but also because look at this. This is how their plans are coming together. COVID surge forces schools to close and bring pandemic era measures and more at the risk of millions as they head back to class next week. You check this out. Schools in two states are experiencing a rise in COVID cases announced they were closing facilities and switching to remote learning. So they already started this nonsense again. Alabama and Tennessee announced the closure of two schools affecting more than a thousand children just days into the new academic year with officials saying the virus had forced them to shut and carry out a deep clean. Listen, I'm saying it to you again. Pay attention to what is happening around you. We have to get ready to push back against these demonic people or else they're gonna take us out. We have to do this. We have to share this information. These demonics, they're on the loose and they're talking about COVID already, sending back children uh, to online or remote learning in two states in the US. People are being distracted all around. Elections in the U.S. This is happening in the Caribbean. War in Ukraine, Israel and Iran. They're just doing a lot of things to take up your time and distract you from what they're really going to do again. Remember the plan, September to February next year. That is when everything will be going down. We are up against demonic forces out to get us, more specifically, the children, so you have to be on your knees, people, and share this information so others could be awake because while you're sleeping, they are working in their labs to destroy us. So you got to prepare yourself, prepare yourself, share this information, share it with all your friends, share it far and wide, and we will come back to discuss more of this another time around. Just remember, I said to you, new incurable infection, and you heard from that lady in the video that they're doing these things they're making these things in the lab they're doing these things and then they tell us nature is bringing this upon us but they're messing with nature to destroy us so we have to push back spiritually but remember the date it's going to be september 2024 to february 2025 that's when it's going down all these nations have already been briefed